Hello and welcome! I'm Knight Valen and this is the Valen and we are on Batcraft! Yay! Um, today's gonna be an interesting little episode. Um, we're here in uh, New New York. New New York town as far as I know. Um, and it's nighttime. Oh, it's nice. I figured I'd look around, but before before I do, I want to ensure that we have some uh, basalt here for Bo, uh, because I know he uses the basalt for his roads. So that way he has a, a small. It's 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 what I could get in a short time. He'll have access to some basalt. Um, so let's actually set up a sign. I think. The normal price is well first let's type in basalt and I think the normal price is two no no yeah it's two to bleh, I can type two stacks let me get my fingers on the keyboard geez four one diamond And there we go. It's kind of hard to see under there, so let's try that again. Ugh. Basalt is two stacks of oops, four, one, diamond. There. Now that's in place, and it's daytime. That'll make it a lot easier to actually see. So that way, Bo should be able to start on... I, I don't know when he's planning on starting on um, his part two build, but right now he's, as far as I understand, uh, act one of his new New York town is uh, done, including... A Batmobile. Is that a chessboard? No, it's not a chessboard. I thought it was a chessboard. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. Uh, so we got the Batmobile. We have Prime Moving Van. Truck thing. Uh, this is the first time I've actually come over here to look at this stuff. So, Because I've been meaning to not show off too much of other people's stuff. Let's see if I can hop up there. Yeah. Oh yeah, Petmobile. Oh, <laughs> it has a little trail. Uh, it's a shame Minecraft doesn't have certain. Oh, uh, I'm trapped. Uh, certain building blocks of. T Oops. Oh well, I didn't do it. Uh, um, yeah, certain building blocks because then the Batmobile could have like, like there could be like a telephone pole there and there could be like a grappling hook attached to it, help make that tight turn. But this is also Minecraft, so who knows, maybe vehicles drive like that. <laughs> uh, they don't take gradual turns, they just sharply turn uh, 45. Ooh, what's this? This is interesting, we have an H. I like what he did with the lanterns. And we have this little staircase. Let's go up here. Just, this episode is just going to be a whole lot of me looking at things. So if that's not for you, uh, sorry. Uh, though, this probably will be the last episode I have for a while. Um, so I have to take a three-month hiatus. I have a project I need to work on. Um, my business partner is hard at work on his prototype for his video game. Um, so I will be helping out by drafting up some concept art for him. Uh, that way we can get that ushered off to some artists. Oh, is that a statue? Oh, that's cool. I like that. Very nice. Very nice indeed. I've been meaning to make a statue over at Valenco. Oh, on the grass. <laughs> this is very nice. 
in this nether portal. Um, but yeah, I'll be helping out in uh, doing some art and maybe some sound effects and or music tracks of some sort. Uh, most of it will just be prototype stuff or, or concept stuff. Uh, we'll, we'll hire real artists to do the real stuff. Uh, I also would like to start uh, working on a few of my own prototypes. Uh, I have started working on, or had, have. It's ready for a test phase, but I have a uh, tradable card game that's all set to go, but uh, again, that's going to require some more art. Uh, it's going to require more time for uh, alpha testing and getting some artists in to actually do some of the card art. Um, I do have concept art for it, so at least that's further along than a lot of the other stuff we're working on. But I'm taking the three months off to help him out with his... Uh, I like these lampposts. Um, helping him take care of some of the concept stuff for his prototype game. Um, so I won't be around for about three months. Um, and that means I won't even be on this server. I'm going to miss it. This is, kinda, this is another reason why I just want to look around. We got the uh, St. Martha Hospital. We got all foods. Um, I'm not sure what this is. This. What this? Oh, maybe I see. So he breeds villagers in there and then trucks them in that way. Got it, got it, got it. And he, yeah. So let's see. We have the blue building. I'm not sure what this building's for. Um, I'm not sure there's a way into the, oh, there is a way into this building. I should just keep... Oh, this is a pub! Nice! Yorktown pub. Pull up, get a seat. And uh, he hasn't named his villagers yet. Um, from what I understand, there are a lot of people going, you should name them after the guy, uh, the bartenders on Cheers. I have no idea. It's like Woody and somebody. Okay, so we're... we're Doing some farming of some sort here. What kind of farm is this? Do 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 do. I'm not gonna be able to get up there to check. I wonder if that's a. I guess we could just check here, huh? Oh, wool, wool. <laughs> Creepy faces. The Batman. I'm still proud of this map that I had. Fox make um, even though recently we've been blaming maps for a lot of the lag Fox had a uh, mountain base near Gotham uh, that had quite a few lab or, uh, maps and when he moved them some of the lag went away so uh, I'm not sure that's the case that it was um, entirely maps I know I let up a lot of the caves underneath Gotham, and that helped immensely. Um, what's this? Oh, this is the mob farm. The Hotel Le Pablion. The mob farm. And this is his coffee bean, or uh, coffee shop. I like his coffee shop. It's even got like a walk-up window. I think I've showed this off before, but I st still like it. I still like it. And this, I guess, is where he grows his cocoa beans. Um, it's funny, I, I usually only farm cocoa beans when I need them. And I don't need them very often. Brown is not a very pretty color. And this must be uh, soon to be a fountain, I'm guessing. Well, he's got the exterior of the building done, but nothing much in the interior. Uh, recently we did start working on Wayne Manor in Gotham. Uh, I think we're done here. I don't really... Oh, right, right, right. So, um, I won't be able to work on this, obviously, because of the whole three-month hiatus thing. 
All right, let's go back to Gotham. Shouldn't take too long fly-wise. I do want to show off um, what we have gotten started for Wayne Manor, which is supposed to be a team build. Um, I did gather up... Uh-oh. Uh there we go. Quite a few resources and, and hopes. Oh, oh yeah. Up here. One more. Um, so I did this, this whole glass ceiling. This is at build height, so you can't build anymore so you, if you tried to place something. Uh, that way it helps prevent snow building up. Because that was starting to actually become an issue down here. And here we have um, the layout for Wayne Manor. And here's the block palette for Wayne Manor. Um, it's it's an interesting block palette, but it's, this is based on a real building in real life. So the block palette is very similar. Though I don't know if it really translates into Minecraft as well as it probably should. Um, and when we tore out a lot, like the chunk of the mountain needed to put this place up here, um, this wall was just left flat and then I was like terraforming this side and eventually I got to the point where like I couldn't really push it back too much more without interfering with the LOS and uh, camo up there. Uh, for those not familiar, uh, LOS is uh, League of Shadows? Um, yeah, and so this right here is supposed to be like a porch for Wayne Manor, as far as I know. Uh, I, I only got reference images, so uh, this project's being headed up by Snowpocalypse, or Snowpockety. Um, so she's working with the other backcrafters to get this project going and underway. So I, I, I did started with this, just this thing, and then I th thought it would be cool to have some kind of like temple like thing in here so i just built this real quick um so yeah it's it's kind of ugly but at the same time it's kind of pretty i like when it it's dark out you know it lights up or is lit up and then dr alien was working over here um and you know he's he's got the mustache bandit hideout i think that's the mustache bandit I'm not sure, but he built this thing, and I like how he's got the little mustache there and this little walkway up, all the banners, kind of obfuscating it a little bit. And yeah, there's the Mustachio Bandit, the little hideout. I haven't, act have I been in there? I can't remember if I've been in there. I think I've been in there. I just don't think I've been in there on video, so let's go check that out. He's got an amazing view of Gotham, or at least lower Gotham. So that's nice. That's nice. Uh, got his little desk here. A little fireplace. Oh, this is so cute. This is so cute. I like it. Oh, there's a downstairs. The plot thickens. It's just a little storage area. Okay. That just goes back outside. And we've got a map. Upper and lower Gotham. Oh, yeah. I should probably show that off. Um, close that door. I don't like leaving doors open, whether they're trap doors or otherwise. Unless, of course, it's part of a build. But that was, uh, was not meant to be open, I don't think. Yeah, so we have all kinds of goodies over here for building this. Um, I won't be a part of this after today, because, uh, again, I'll be working on other, th other projects. I uh, will definitely miss Batcraft. I won't miss fall <laughs> failing to land on things. Alright, so let's get over here. So I did buy a large swath of land uh, that used to be uh, Fox's Corporation. And uh, I turned it into a park. These benches look bad, but <laughs> it's what I can do 
I did this in a very short period of time, unfortunately. Everything has been... There's just not been enough time in the day lately. That's why I have to give up something so that I can work on uh, things that are important to me. Uh, I'm not saying that Batcraft isn't important. It is, but... And now this is Fox's new building. Uh, I believe he said... Oh. Did I hear a phantom? I did. Running! I moved all my stuff on the inside. Including the bed. Running, running, running. Let me just get in here, go to sleep, survive the night. I think there's a song about that somewhere. Alright. So that should take care of the phantom problem. Our phantom menace. Um, yeah, so we got the we got some lights and stuff. Lights it up at night. It's nothing fancy. Uh, right, we were looking at Fox's new uh, building because he he sold this chunk to me. It was really funny actually, because I was like, "All right, I will pay the difference," and I think it was something like uh, sixty something diamonds was what he was asking for and then um i was like oh i'll buy that that that's easy i got i got the money and then uh dr alien started he was like oh I, i'll pay i'll pay 80 diamonds and i was like oh really uh, 90 diamonds and eventually our bidding war ended up with me paying 150 i think diamonds for this chunk of land um uh, you know I, I really wanted it because i wanted to have a park uh, a place for the Greener Gotham group to also have a meeting place because I was going to build like a little hovel kind of thing over there, a little meeting house. Um, and then, you know, actually set up this park. And it's perfect because it's right across the street from Vale Co. So uh, I'm really glad Fox sold me the chunk of land for that purpose. Because um, look at his new building here. This is looking great. Uh, originally he was building it all yellow and then he asked if if we liked it if people liked it and I don't think he liked it I think the reason why he was asking is because he wanted confirmation to get rid of all the yellow um, so he put up like a poll and um, I think two people said they didn't like it and like two people said they liked it and everyone else pretty much commented that they they just wanted to stay out of it <laughs> they had no opinion on the matter and fox was like all i need is one no and i will tear all the yellow out but then snow was like i really like the yellow against the turquoise so you should probably leave one section yellow and i i agree that looks it looks pretty good i think fox just wants his building to look really nice and this is uh, all he's got so far uh, it's a shame he doesn't do videos because I would love to see how this progresses. Anyway, let. I'm curious. I'm curious if they've done anything new. I know Will was put in charge of the police department. Nothing. I mean, it's got more of a wall now. Nothing new in here. Snow is put in charge of parks and rec and stuff like that. So hopefully my park is gonna be okay for now uh i'll have to get with her and see if she'll maybe tweak it oh yes oh yes oh yes so bo's easter mess uh we all decided to help clean up and leave the remainder for him to deal with later um i was kind of hoping that they would have Ooh, what was that unsigned legislation huh and you know we have our past and failed we haven't had any failed yet we have prop 2 by Fox that was voted on that was the uh, Gotham land expansion act I believe it was called or something like that um, where we would just terraform more of Gotham of course they're there are other projects in place right now that other people are working on. Unf Everybody's getting busy, 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 including me. So a lot of the projects are kind of at a standstill. I think all of this yellow territory, this was supposed to be 
torn up. Uh, I think this is probably going to be uh, Wayne Enterprises, either that or over here. I I know there was some white markers too. Yep, yep. So it's probably all of this area in general, this whole thing they want to tear out and then build Wayne Enterprises and a few other things. Uh, I know they have plans for Ace Chemicals and things like that too. So it would be kind of interesting to come back three months from now and see what, what's gotten done. Um, you know, it's, it's... I can't... It's been like four months? Maybe five months? I can't remember. We've been here for a little while. Look at the bats and the Christmas tree. I love Snow's Christmas tree. All right. So I guess all that's left to do is bore... Oh, not get in there. Uh, we got to board up Vale and Co. And let everyone know we're closed for the foreseeable future. The next three months minimum. One, two, three. One, two, three. And we'll just come inside. And this is where we'll sit. Oh, I guess I have to put up a sign. Do, 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 do. Close the... Oh, no, 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 no. We don't like that. Let's try again. Closed till further notice. Night Valen. And there we go. It stayed. I didn't think you could go below. I thought there was only four lines, but that seemed like it was five lines. All right. Well, either way, that's that. Oh, 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 oh. Sai. Sai is also hard at work. She's been processing away because camo had been activated. So maybe she will have some results for our machine. I know we have a very basic design here, but uh, it, it has... It's, it's got some bugs. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I've been Knight Valen. I hope to see you in a couple of months. Um, take care of yourself and bye bye.